Hey everyone, Chris here. Welcome back to the channel. We're back for another hunt. Hopefully things go well. A little over 1,500. Um, these, from my experience, are off coin machine. These, last time, I'll link it up here, did really, really well for me, the black holes. These are from Brinks. I don't get these too often, but there is one bank that does give them to me. So hopefully another good batch there. Nothing obvious on the ends. I'll tell you what, uh, these latest NF String and Sun boxes with the December 08 stamp have been utterly terrible. As good as things were at the end of 2023, it has been very, very slow to start 2024. Hopefully it changes with these boxes and this over here. Let's dig in, see what we can find. All right, so I decided to start with these coin machine rolls and wouldn't you know it, we got some goodies. This is breaking a significant drought for me. Something like 10 boxes since I've seen a silver. 40% are 1969D. While I have you, why don't we just go into this one? I did not set up here because these boxes have been just atrocious lately. So I've just been kind of turning the camera on as needed, which has not been a lot as of late. Anything in here? Does not look like it. Anyway, we did get a silver. Breaks a long skunk street. Back in we go. We'll start with these black rolls. Sweet. Well, I'm back with you. This is roll number seven. <sighs> Sight for sore eyes. You see that 40 down in there? That just looks fantastic. It has been so very long up until this hunt since I found a silver. 1967. Sweet. Another 40 on the board. That gives me hope for the rest of uh, these Brinks rolls here. Roll seven. We got silver. Well, there we got it. This is box number one. Once you know it, roll number 50. It's got a little goodie in there. Final roll magic. That's a silver. 40 percenter, 1968D. Great. Two in a box. I love that. That cartwheel. It's still there. Original mint luster. Love these black rolls. They've been doing really good lately. These, not so much, but we're hopeful. Fingers crossed. We find something good in there. Well, that's it. Boxes two and three. Complete skunkers. Not even an NIFC. Tell you what, though. It's nice to at least see some silver. This doubles my yearly total, and we're in February now. Not very good. 340% or so added to the tally you see there at the bottom. Two NIFCs as well coming in out of those black rolls. A 2007 and a 2020, both out of Denver. Three more silvers added to the stack. We're not giving up, folks. Paying your dues. That's what this is called. Uh, in a rash of skunks on several of those uh, NF String and Sun boxes. Hope it turns around soon. But this is kind of the nature of the beast. Sometimes you go on these long stretches. Sometimes you have some successful stretches in there. Right now, it is the former for me. Hoping to change it around. Thanks for watching, everyone. Uh, not quite enough for a standalone video. So you know what? We're going to add on another half. Stay tuned. Working on a couple boxes here. This one was short, a couple of rolls. Got a better number. Um, those were providing for me when I was able to get them. Uh, yeah, so this one had 42 rolls. So if you do the math, I'm in on this one. Uh, 12. You can just barely see it. If I turn it, you can see that 40% right there at the end of my finger. Otherwise, it was kind of hard to see at first. I just happened to catch the light on it just right. 1969D. Let's go. We'll get back into this. Ah, uh, six rolls from the end. You see what I'm seeing? Uh, something suspicious in there. It looks kind of goldy tinted, but I don't know. Let's look together and see what we can find. Yeah, it's one of those dipped um, 1973s. A little worse for wear. Could tell it wasn't quite normal. Run of these every now and again. Uh, 
nothing too fancy about them, but just on the off chance that that was going to be a silver, drop it off. Another Sabatini's Pizza stick of coin, get those occasionally, but it's been a while since I found one. And NIFC and one I'll check for my ugly collection. There's the rest of the roll, no silver, back in we go. Well, short hunt today. For uglies, I'll check my ugly collection, see if those are worthy of being the worst of the bunch. And NIFC 2003. Sabatini's Pizza and one 40%er, 1969. That takes the silver tally up just a skosh. It's been kind of a slow go, pain dooms, but sometimes that's just what happens in this hobby. Appreciate you liking this video, subscribing to the channel if you like my content. We'll keep hunting. Hopefully, we'll find some goodies, more of these goodies in that next box.